I am so fired up right now because we're going to be talking about something that nobody really talks about in e-commerce. When it comes to marketing, we all think everything needs to be digital. We send emails, we run digital ads, we do this, that, this, that. We're online-based companies. Well, today what we're going to talk about is actually direct mail. Yes, I said it, direct mail. Direct mail is something that a lot of people call snail mail, right? It's a lot of, it's something that we don't really talk about much in e-commerce, but with how expensive advertising has become, with the impacts that we've seen to the whole digital e-commerce ecosystem due to iOS 14 and 15 updates, direct mail is coming back. I wouldn't even say it's coming back, it is back right now. And today we're gonna be walking through how you can use direct mail to help grow and scale your e-commerce business. So. First off, why should you be using direct mail? Why should an online e-commerce business be using direct mail right now? The answer to that question is because you as an e-commerce business, you are a direct to consumer business, right? You send things in the mail when someone buys them online. And you, by nature, have a lot of information on where your customers live. You have their shipping addresses. You have their billing addresses, right? You know exactly where they live. That's a key and vital piece of information that's in your database. And you need to monetize that information, right? We need to be hitting customers wherever they are. When they're on their phone, right? We send them ads. We send them an SMS campaign. We send them emails, right? You should be sending direct mail to your customers as well. So let's go back a little ways, right? Like. In today's age, a direct consumer business is considered an e-commerce business. But think about where direct consumer businesses were 15, 20, 30 years ago. People buying stuff and having it shipped to them in the mail is not a new thing by any means. And even before brands had an actual established online business, they were still running direct consumer businesses. They ran catalogs. They would send direct marketing catalogs in the mail to their customers and people would see what they could buy and they would either call up on the phone or they would take out that order phone in the back and they would fill it out, put a check in the mail, sometimes even cash in the mail, take a credit card over the phone and they would transact. And as we go through history, this has been going on for years. So sending things to customers in the mail is not a new thing. People have done it for years. And one of the questions that you might also be asking yourself right now is, Mark, I hate getting things in the mail. I don't like it. It's terrible. It's junk mail. Okay. I'm gonna stop you for one second. And what I want you to think about is the people that are on your email list that have bought from you in the past, people who you have their actual addresses for, these are warm, hot audiences. These are your people. They're going to be excited to hear from you. This is not a credit card company or a, a uh, you know, internet service company or a car extended warranty business that's buying your data and trying to sell you something when you didn't solicit for it. That's not what we're doing here. When we're doing direct mail in the way that I'm explaining it right now, this is all your own first party data, right? This is stuff that you own. These are your customers. So this isn't we're, what we're talking. What we're talking about today is not going out and buying a list of cold people and trying to sell them your stuff. We're not talking about that in this video at all. The platform that we have been using that we found some incredible success with is actually called Postpilot. And Postpilot is essentially the direct mail version of Calavia. When you think about it, it's a Shopify app that integrates in with your back end and actually lets you send campaigns in two of the same ways that you can send email campaigns through Calavio. One, you can send one-off direct mail pieces, right? You can get in the back end of the platform. You can say, I want to send it to everyone that's bought in the last, you know, year from me, last 365 days. Okay, cool. Go in the back end, you make a segment, and it says, there's this many people there. Cool. We get ready. We upload the campaign. We do the design. It's a super simple platform that you can really leverage quite easily. So one-off campaigns, you say, this is the segment I'm going to work with and that I want to send to, and you build the, the creative and it goes out in the mail. So Postpilot handles everything for you. 
They handle the printing, the fulfillment, the labeling. They give you a rate for what it's going to cost for these campaigns. And you essentially buy credits and they fulfill on it. Quite simple. You can create pro promo codes in the back end. You can integrate in a lot of other apps like Calavio as well. You can build coupon codes and you can actually show the ROI off of a campaign. So let's say you're running a direct mail offer specifically to existing customers that have purchased one or more times, but hasn't bought in the last maybe six, seven months. And you want to try to get those customers back to your site and the purchase. Well, we could run a special offer directly to those people to get that in the door. Another great idea um, is anytime you do any big flagship sales, great use case for running direct mail right now is actually sending out a direct mail piece to your, to your VIPs or high level customers and letting them know that the sale is starting on a specific date, right? This keeps you top of mind with your customers, right? They get something in the mail. They're excited to hear from you. They then take that little postcard of the direct mail piece and they put it on their desk. They pin it up on the wall. They put the date in their calendar. They do all these things to connect and get things moving quite fast. So great use case right now, which I would recommend is plan out to send a direct mail piece in the mail somewhere between five to seven days before your sale goes live. So this keeps you top of mind and keeps your customers ready to rock and roll as you go into there. We want to make sure people remember you while they're shopping. We want to make sure they're spending those dollars with you. That's the whole goal here. So direct mail piece here, one-off campaigns is a great use case. Another great use case too, is as you go into your regular product launch strategy, when you're launching new specific products, is sending out direct mail pieces to your VIPs, letting them know about the new products, what it's about, what's happening, and then obviously one-off flash sales. And then as we go into the second side, we're gonna talk about automation. So another great use case is building out automation in the back end of Postpilot, right? We can build out automation and send campaigns once someone triggers into a specific segment, similar to what we can do on email, and SMS and even push with automation, you can do the same thing on Postpilot, right? In the back end and actually send out. What's really good about this is you're triggering a specific user within a user journey and you're not blasting a couple hundred to a couple thousand pieces of the mail and just hoping it's gonna work. Your ROI off of these programmatic automation sends on direct mail are going to be massive wins. Really good use of this right now is a win back campaign. So once someone's visited your site and they made a purchase and they haven't purchased in you know three to six months, get them in with the win back offer. Get them to come back, right? Great use case right there. Also abandoned cart, also post purchase or when someone enters into a VIP segment. This is a great use case to connect with your customers on a whole other level than you've been able to before. So post pilot, like I said, it makes everything really easy to just build in there. They actually have a design editing tool with a bunch of different templates in there. You can upload your own designs. You can do stuff in there. We're going to be doing a lot more over the next few months with just exploring direct mail because it's produced some massive wins for our clients. And since my team and I are the SEAL Team 6 of retention uh, with our Retention Labs program, this is a big tool and a big pillar that we're trying to drive home, especially with just how challenging things have been over the last six months with paid social advertising in general. So I hope this video is helpful. If you're looking for some support or you want to chat with me or my team about how we could help you actually implement post pilot for your e-commerce brand, we work with direct consumer brands that are doing anywhere from 750,000 to 40 million a year in revenue. And we manage everything from their email, SMS, app push, and direct mail and automation. We handle everything A to Z. If you're looking for some support here, I'm going to put a link on where you can connect with us down below in the show notes. And let's schedule a call. Let's see what's happening. And we're always happy to help. So with that being said, I hope this video is helpful. Let me know if you have any questions in the notes as well. I'm happy to get back to it. Channel's not that big, but we love to be as high touch with everyone as possible. So I hope that's helpful. Thanks, everyone. Talk to you later.